So let's break down the components of LLM agents. The first capability is the ability to reason, which we talked about. So this is putting the model at the core of how problems are being solved. The model will be prompted to come up with a plan and to reason about each step of the process along the way. Another capability of agents is the ability to act. And this is done by external programs that are known in the industry as tools. So tools are external pieces of the program and the model can define when to call them and how to call them in order to best execute the solution to the question they've been asked. So an example of a tool could be search, searching uh, the web, searching a database at their disposal. Another example could be a calculator to do some math. This could be a piece of program code that maybe might manipulate a database. This can also be another language model that maybe you're trying to do a translation task and you want a model that can be able to do that. And there's so many other possibilities of what can do here. So these could be APIs, basically any piece of external program you want to give your model access to. Third capability, that is the ability to access memory. 